All right, so Leo, this will be your personal life. So this will be what's going on in your personal life right now. For my Leo spirit, what's happening in Leo's personal life? Okay, we got concern for your first card. Somebody can be 33 or maybe even 66. Somebody can have six children, three to six children, three, four, or six. We got 37. Somebody can be 37 or maybe even 73. Some of you guys could be concerned about a mother figure or a father figure that may be struggling right now. I don't know why. Maybe it could be your grandparents, Leo, or it can be your mother. Maybe your mother or your father could be like up in age and you could be concerned about, you know, like how are they going to pay their bills, their rent. Now, if this is not them, it could be you. I just picked up on that energy for somebody. Now, this is not, like I said, this is not them. It could be you. Maybe you're concerned about you know, where you're going to go. Maybe you guys could be struggling right now. Some of you guys could be homeless. Maybe you live in a shelter or you live with somebody else. If not, it could just be saying that you could be struggling right now and concerned about your security, your stability, Leo, and, you know, how you're going to overcome that and, um, instability. Yeah, if this is not you, it could be somebody around you. But I am seeing that some of you guys have, like, parents. Maybe you live with a parent. Or your parents may live with you or one parent may live with you. Y'all just take what resonates. But somebody is concerned about somebody's like security and their stability. Whether this is you or somebody around you. Some of you guys have like a water sign parent that may be up in age i am seeing that maybe it could be like a cancer or scorpio um or a pisces they they could be struggling right now in living in their living conditions right now maybe their house could be falling apart maybe they need money for or or this could be you i don't know why but spirit is pointing this energy towards somebody around you so some of you guys if this is not you it can be somebody around you like your kids maybe your it can be your parents or your kids if your kids are grown, that could be struggling right now in regards of, you know, their living situation. Maybe somebody's house got a leak. Maybe somebody's roof need to be fixed. Maybe some, the pipes could be could be all messed up. Maybe they could be bursting. I don't know, but somebody's house could be falling apart. And they really don't have the money to, like, I'm here for maintenance. Like, maybe you, you need, maybe you have bills. Maybe you have plumbing that you need to pay for out of pocket in order to get certain things fixed in your house and you just somebody feel like they don't have the money they could be struggling to you know I don't know I just feel like somebody could be struggling to hold down this household even though it's falling apart and it could be you or it could be somebody around you Leo I'm just picking up on that energy for somebody but there is something that yes you could be avoiding to let go of Leo And it could be a home. Somebody's home could be falling apart. In some, it's either that you could be avoiding letting it go, or somebody could be avoiding avoiding it letting it go. Whether it's something to do with you or a child of yours that has a house that's falling apart and they need to get rid of it if they can't pay for it, or it could just be you or a parent. I don't know why I'm getting that in. It's somebody real close to you if it's not you. Some of y'all, it is you. That's too many cards. But we got the high priestess reverse. It's like somebody trying to ignore it because they, they just don't want to accept the simple fact that it's real, that it's happening, that something is falling apart. Some of y'all could be a relationship. Maybe you could just be concerned about somebody walking away from you because most of y'all could just be concerned about your kids. If you have younger kids, maybe you could just be concerned about your children that, you know, in a mix of you struggling right now, maybe you just, like I said, maybe you just feel like you need to know, like you need a roof over your head, like you're trying to figure out where you're going to go. If you're, you know, if you do decide to walk away from a living situation or a person, 
because some of y'all do depend on your lover if you are in a relationship with somebody but maybe you could be concerned on if they will leave you and leave you struggling with just the children alone it's like there could be a lot on your mind right now a lot of y'all have a lot of things on your plate especially certain things that you have been avoiding now if there is a love interest that you have been avoiding to end a connection with this person is going to end like leave you on their own they will especially if this is something that you've been like afraid of happening of them leaving you i feel like they will end up walking away and you will find out where they walked away to or why they walked away i'm seeing so many different messages so y'all just take what resonates leo you know what? Let me pull one more of these and then I'm going to clarify another one. Yeah, some of y'all have been avoiding um, something or someone. Or somebody around you been avoiding something or someone. Like avoiding ending a connection or a housing situation or something. <clears throat> some of y'all could be dealing with a Scorpio or a Pisces or a Cancer. I've been seeing a lot of water energy in y'all chart. Or maybe you could be cross-watching you could maybe your maybe a sun sign could be a water sign and you could have Leo in your chart. Wow, but there is something that's getting ready to turn around in your favor, Leo. If you are the one that's going through this struggle in regards of your like your stability, there's gonna be a turnaround. Some kept telling me to pull another card. It's gonna be a turnaround. After some form of a struggle or hardship that you have been experiencing in your life, it's like there is something that's getting ready to come about. Something that's getting ready to be exposed in a way. Like your struggle is going to expose a lot of people that may have been around you while you were struggling, Leo. That's what I'm picking up on. Because maybe there was people around you seeing you struggle, going through these hardships, but they didn't do nothing about it. You know, they didn't ask you for a helping hand or any of that. But I'm just getting that your hardships, your struggle is going to expose a lot of people, Leo. And because of this, it's like things are, the wheel is about to change. Something is getting ready to turn in your favor, Leo. Let's clarify great portion. Some of y'all, after struggling, you could be coming like coming in with like something is coming in for you like a lump sum of money maybe it was a settlement that you've been with on um, waiting on um maybe it could be a divorce i don't know maybe just, just divorce somebody it could be alimony or something like that if not maybe you could have some child support coming in some of y'all could have money owed to you from support or from alimony or um maybe your house caught on fire i don't know why i'm getting that maybe somebody house caught on fire and they maybe you had insurance you could be getting the money back from when your house caught on fire. Maybe you had, I'm here, renter's insurance or housing insurance. Some of y'all had, is getting something. You could be insured by something. Like you have been covered. Spirit has been covering you for something. If you in spirit, it's something that was already full coverage, Leo. If you lost your house, you could be getting full coverage for that. Um, Like I said, some form of insurance. The rest of you guys... If you have been going through some hardships in your your stability and your money, you got money coming in. If you've been struggling to find a job, you got a job coming in in the form of something like like the money is going to be a lot more than what you had. Because some of y'all come from like a nine to five, like I don't say nine to five, it could be. Maybe you come from a low paying job, we're gonna say that. And now you find a job that make buku money. You know what I'm saying? So some of y'all could be coming from that, from the struggle to I'm hearing from um from poverty to riches for some of you guys. But it's telling me that there is something coming in. Some of y'all do have some money coming in to fix your house. And maybe you could be using that money to fix your house. Or you could be leaving a home, Leo. Because you have been granted some money. Some of you guys could be getting a loan. Maybe you pull out a loan for something to be fixed or for you to get a home or to buy a home or something like that. Y'all got something going in your favor. Regardless what it is, it's going in your favor, Leo. No matter what it is, it's going in your favor. Wow. So y'all going to be celebrating. We got the three of cups right here. This light is dumb. 
you guys are getting ready to celebrate. Like I said, your struggle is going to expose a lot of people. It's like, as soon as that money coming in, oh, here go your friends and your family want to join. You see what I'm saying? That's the energy that I'm picking up on. People want all, all of a sudden want to get next to you. Want to, oh, let's go out. Let's go have some drinks. Let's go do this. Let's go to, let's go out, you know, let's go on vacation. I don't know. But it seems like people are going to be exposed. Maybe you, some of you guys find it like you was concerned about releasing something or someone. But it's like the hard times that you have been through, Leo, it literally did expose everybody. This is all you need to know. Because even, even if you thought about cutting people off, right? Even if you thought about cutting people off because things were crumbling down in your life and you feel like you didn't have the support that you were looking for, just know that it's like as soon as that money come rolling in, it's going to expose all the fake. It really is. It's going to expose everybody, literally. And um, I just felt like things are going to start to like come together for you, Leo. Things are going to prosper for you, Leo. Y'all going to be in... In a form of abundance. Money in, in a form of abundance. That's exactly what Spirit is telling me for some of my Leos. But it's telling me that people are going to be really exposed. All because you were struggling. You know, and they want to get next to you. But I am seeing some form of celebration. You will realize that. Because it's like, when you were struggling, where was everybody at? That's the energy that I'm picking up on. It was like everything was falling apart in your life, Leo. And it's like the minute you get this money, all of a sudden it's like your luck starts to change. Things start to like things start to expand triple. And I'm talking about in a good way. Like, that's crazy. Hard times expose expose fake people. We got expression right here. Somebody could be trying to, like, explain themselves now because they could be struggling. I don't know why, but some of y'all could be looking to write a book. Maybe you write poetry if, you, if you're not looking to write a book. Some of you guys could be, you know, journalizing some things. Maybe you could be jotting down your thoughts about. Some of y'all are manifesting. Maybe you could be buying you, like, a journal, Leo, and manifesting you some things, like some money. That's for some of my Leos. So, like I said, these are mixed messages, so y'all just take what resonates. But some of y'all are definitely, like, getting a journal, and you could be jotting some things down about what it is that you want, Leo, in your life. If you ain't writing a book. Because some of y'all could be writing a book about your struggles. Or you could be thinking about wanting to write a book about what it is that you have been through, Leo. We got looking. It says, you need work that lets you express your creative self. You could do well at writing, blogging, or a career in communication. So some of you guys could be, I don't know why, but maybe you could be somebody that could be an influencer in a way. And you could be telling people the things that you have went through, Leo. Like I said, I kept hearing pop from, from rags to riches. I kept hearing that. Some of y'all is going to come from rags to riches, Leo. But... I am seeing that. I'm hearing real situation, real situations expose fake people. I'm hearing that also. And maybe you could be writing a book about what it is that you have been through, Leo. And it's sad to say because your struggles, like people watched you struggle because we got money matters and then we got looking. So you struggling in the financial department of your life, people know they seen you struggling. The same people that want to be together with you, that want to, you know, be in cahoots with you or whatever. It's like, they're the same people that want to be around you when you got money in your pocket. Because they, you were struggling. When you were struggling, they was watching you the whole time. Now you got that bag. Now you got that money. It's like, they want to be part of it. This is wild. Let me clarify. 
and see what this energy about to look like because somebody is literally could be like coming in your life trying to explain to you that they could be struggling right now leo but this person could be deceptive Some of you other people are never satisfied. So if you are giving somebody something, they're not never satisfied, Leo. They're not. Y'all be careful, because some of y'all be being nice to the wrong people. Somebody could be like, literally, let me be quiet. <laughs> some of y'all is going through that, though. Like, somebody could be literally struggling right now, and it's the same people that watched you struggle that didn't give you no helping hand. And they could be asking you for money. Because they struggling. They see you got that money that rolled in. Now they want a piece of the pie. They only care about themselves. Whatever they got to say. It's fake love. This is all fake love. Y'all be careful with this energy. This is all fake love. It's all fake. It's fake love. It's only because of money. Some of y'all spirits saying y'all need to watch y'all money, y'all spending when it comes to y'all money. Some of y'all, y'all need to watch y'all spending, whether you give it to somebody else and loan, you know, a helping hand or whether you are overspending. Some of y'all could be watching y'all money, but it is telling me that y'all got people that's showing fake love to you. Look, they, and they did not say they betrayed you. I feel like they betrayed you. It's like they're watching your money, right? But they could be wanting to act. They, like they could be only going to get close to you because of you got money coming in. I don't know why I keep hearing money, money, money. <laughs> but some of y'all just walked away from somebody, though. Maybe you did express your love to somebody and they walked away from you, Leo, for some of you guys. Some of y'all people walked away from you because you were struggling. It's sad because I feel like some of y'all was looked down upon because during your hard times, you may not look it, you know, things may not look it good on the outside, you know, but it's like the same people, okay, when you were struggling financially, Leo, those are the people that turned their back on you, Leo. Now that you got some money coming in. It's like people watching you. They want to see if you're going to struggle. They want to see you fall. Some people could be watching you to see see you fall, to see you struggle. Y'all be careful. Y'all got nothing but fake people around y'all. It's like they want to spend your money with you. The same people that watch you suffer is the same people that want to spend your money with you just so you can fall off again. That's exactly what I'm seeing. Some of y'all do have those. Some of y'all are influencers in a way. And y'all could be struggling in that department. And people could be watching you struggle. But like I said, these people are fake. They fake. You walking away from them because you know they ain't no good. To me. Somebody feels betrayed. Somebody feels betrayed. There's a love interest, Leo, that you have walked away from a while ago, right? Or could be recently, that feels betrayed because they're struggling financially. And mind you, this is after the fact that you have already told this person how you felt about, about them. Maybe you did love them at the time, but they rejected you because I'm seeing that. Some of y'all did pour your heart out to somebody, but they rejected you. Some of y'all, there could be somebody that may have wrote a letter and they still rejected it don't have to be in the form of a letter. It can be a text message. It can just be you telling this person how you feel on the phone and they rejected you because you are somebody that may have been struggling at the time. You may not have had your life the way you wanted it. And they and they like they turned their back on you because of your because of what you what you looked like on the outside, Leo. But I am seeing that you guys stepped your game up. And get back on track, Leo. And people is watching that. It's like some people are like plotting to see you fall. A lot of people don't have your good, your best interest at heart, Leo. They don't. It don't matter who it is. They just don't. They don't have your best interest at heart. 
It's like they want to watch you fail. They want to. I just did a reading something like this where I, where people wanted to watch you fail. I, that's the title of the video. They wanted to see you fail. And this could tie into this situation. But now, like I said, they're going to be watching you take off now. Because you you the queen of wands right here. You ain't give up. They didn't stop nothing. That, listen, that betrayal turned you to a monster. That betrayal turned you to a beast. That betrayal made you go. Like, all it took for you to do was get yourself back in alignment, Leo. And, and keep it pushing. And keep it moving. And pay these haters dust. Because some of y'all did. Some of y'all are paying y'all haters, y'all enemies dust. Whoever looked down on you because you was at a certain level in life, you are paying these people dust. And now they got to watch you thrive. They got to watch you win. Some of y'all have people gang stalking y'all or ganging up on y'all. It could be physically ganging up on y'all. Maybe people trying to fight y'all. I don't know, but I feel like some of y'all grew up. I don't know why I'm getting this energy, but some of y'all grew up where all like mostly all your life there there's just been people that has like underestimated you and looked down on you because you looked a certain way or you lived a certain lifestyle, Leo. And now that you are winning, it's like people are watching you and they just want to get next to you, but you don't forget about that betrayal, Leo. You don't forget about who turned their back on you and made you feel some type of way. You don't forget about what you went through. You don't forget about what you went through. You don't forget about how people made you feel or any of that. Because some of y'all got people from like that seen you struggling at one point in time in your life. And now, for an example, like you could be on Facebook posting your accomplishments or whatever, or your new business or something like that, or maybe you just got a degree or something. Now, all of a sudden, the same people that was watching you struggle, they could be like congratulating you, wanting to be all in your comment section. Some of y'all got people just flat out watching you, stalking you, you know, just watching you make magic. Y'all manifested this. Didn't I say some of y'all jotting things down? Y'all are manifesting something. That's exactly what I'm seeing. Things taking off for you. That's all I got to say. Like, things are going in your favor, Leo. Things are about to expand. Yes, people going to want to get closer to you once you get this money in your pocket. You know, but they only want to they only want to get close to you because you win it. That's it. They only want to get close to you when you win it. And then when the money gone, then what? They're going to be watching you, stalking you again, struggling, not asking you, do you want, do you need help? Those are the type of people that y'all got in y'all circle. They only want to be around you when the funds come in. But when the money get tight, when the money get gone and it get tight, it's like they don't want anything to do with you. Y'all be careful because this ain't nothing but fake people and fake love. They fake. What else going on with Leo personally, Spirit? Look, y'all are going to be very safe and secure. I don't know what's up with this light. Y'all are going to be very safe and secure, Leo, in, in the form of abundance, I'm hearing. In a form, y'all finding yourself. Some of y'all found y'all purpose. That could be what it was. Whether you could be somebody who write books, write poetry, somebody could be, I'm hearing some of y'all could be a living testimony to other people about the certain things that you have went through, Leo. Some of y'all then went back to church, I'm hearing. Some of y'all have became very godly, spiritual. I'm just getting a sense of security and stability within yourself, Leo. You have secured yourself, Leo. You have bounced back from something that was meant to destroy you, something that was meant to break you, Leo. Look. Nothing but money. As y'all can see, y'all ain't got nothing but money coming in this spread. Good fortune, money, matters, and then it's like, bang. I'm hearing double or triple streams of income coming in. All because you found your spot. Like, you found what it is that you are made of. Like, something that you really want to do. It's like you're building from that. And you expanding something. Some of y'all could be expanding a work, a, a business. You could be expanding a, um, your career or something. Maybe you have a career, but you want another one. I don't know. Something like that. Some of y'all could be expanding y'all wealth. Some of y'all definitely secure in the bag. That's exactly what Spirit keep telling me. Some of y'all come from rags to riches. 
Y'all taking good care of y'all self. Y'all good, taking good, good care of y'all health. When this money come in, spirits, then y'all need to get some sleep. Because, listen, things are about to take off, honey. Things are about to take off, and you're going to need some rest. Get y'all some sleep. Get y'all some sleep, because y'all think y'all about to get real, real busy, Leah. Look, then I say people going to want to be close to you. People going to want to be around you when they see that money rolling in. When they see that money rolling in, they want to be around you. Spirit said, take care of yourself. Because when you were struggling, nobody cared. Nobody cared. They watched your life fall apart, you know, and they you felt betrayed. They made you feel like shit. I'm going to be honest with y'all, Leo. Y'all had people that made you feel like shit. And then it's like, it turned you to a beast, though. It did. That betrayal turned you to a beast. And you have just been manifesting and manifesting and manifesting. You never gave up on yourself. You were very determined to win, Leo. You know, but like I said, y'all got a lot of good things coming in in the form of money. Spirit is saying just get y'all some sleep. Get y'all some sleep. Things coming together for you, Leo. It is. Then I say it turned you to a beast. Because of your strength, because of your courage, because you never gave up, Leo. You never gave up. Y'all on the right path. Y'all are definitely on the right path to success, Leo. But I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up. I hope it resonates. And y'all take care.